We've hired a replacement for one of our teachers, Tom Holland, who has moved out of town. Michael Schofield is taking his place. There was no gap in this process, so we are able to assign Michael without placing a temporary vacancy. We will begin by searching for all classes that Tom Holland taught. Navigating to the search tab, we will select course section, and this time we will click advanced and type in Holland and hit search. All of the classes that Tom Holland teaches display. We will expand the first section, click on Tom Holland. It navigates to the section information tab, so we will scroll down and click on the section staff history tab. Next, we will click on new primary teacher and we will select Schofield from the drop down list. After we do that, we're going to enter the start date to which Michael Schofield took over the classes. He took over the classes on 917. So we'll type in 917 and hit save. It notifies us that it's going to end date the primary teacher as of 916. We will then click OK. If the teacher is remaining at your location and should no longer see the sections that they are not teaching, you will then want to click on them and navigate to access section dates and put in the same date range down here. So again, we will type in 916. What this does is in addition to end dating his assignment to the class, it also end dates his ability to see this class in the drop down. We will now click save. We have replaced Tom Holland with Michael Schofield, effective 917. We'll try this one more time. Clicking on the next section, we will click new primary teacher from the drop down. We will select Michael Schofield, put in the start date of 917, hit save, click OK. Tom Holland was end dated. We will also go down to Tom Holland, click on date range, and put in the same end date under access to section. You would repeat this for all of the classes that Tom Holland teaches.